E ale, ale, e ale, ale. Hello guys, it's time to check my favorite club in Greece and that's Olympiakos. We are going to see everything about this amazing club with amazing fans. First, let's see training facilities. Olympiakos has really nice stadium, capacity around 30,000. Training facilities are 15, youth facilities 16, junior coaching 14, youth recruitment is really great 19, and corporate facilities are 14. So maybe it's not a bad idea to invest a little bit in training facilities. Okay, and now let's see the best tactic and formation for Olympiakos. Okay guys, so this would be my first team and I would play in formation 4-2-3-1. An attack has advanced forward, still El Arabi. Then left side, Masuras as inverted winger support UT. Valbuena attacking with the support UT and Fortunis uh, winger. Or you can play with the Fortunis as attacking midfielder and you, you should put Bruma then on the right side as a winger. Bruma is very fast, that's great. Uh, but crossing is only 10, that's the only problem about Bruma, but I like fast players. Okay, then Movila as a deep line playmaker and Camara box to box midfielder. Uh, then we have two complete wing backs uh, on the right, left side, Ruben, on the right side, Rafinha. Rafinha is uh, older, he's 34, but still a fantastic wing back. They're going to roam from position, uh, they're going to help attack, so they're, they're also very important for this tactic. Then ball playing defender Semedo and Sisa as a normal central defender because he doesn't have technique to play as a ball playing defender. On the goal, I would use Jose Sa. I mean, uh, He's injured at the beginning of the season, but uh, still the best goalkeeper at Olympiakos. Okay, now let's check all the players and their current and potential abilities. We can see that the best player at Olympiakos right now is Ruben Semedo, central defender, 26 years old, current ability 135. He's really, really good central defender, fantastic in the air, very strong, and natural fitness, uh, awesome. Okay, then next is uh, Costas Fortunis. In real life, many injuries destroyed his career, but he is still an awesome uh, player. Great technique, great first touch, uh, great dribbling. Okay, then we have Al Arabi. He's 33 and that's the biggest problem, uh, but still the best striker at Olympiakos. Uh, next is Rafinha. 34 years old, uh, wing back, uh, fantastic wing back, uh, but 34 years old, that's a problem. His current ability is 135. Then we have Albuana, a French wild playmaker. As you see, guys, we have many old players. That's the biggest problem for Olympiakos. Uh, you need to find some wunderkids, that's for sure. You need to build a little bit younger squad. That's my opinion. Okay, and then we have Pepe, he's uh, 23 years old, Portuguese deep line playmaker, he's awesome. And, uh, but the, uh, the biggest problem is that he's injured at the beginning of the season, so this is why I'm using uh, Mavila. But then you can change Pepe with uh, Mavila, at least Pepe is younger. Okay, uh, then we have uh, Medic Camara, fantastic box-to-box -box mister. Uh, we see that he is a uh, really, really classy box-to-box -box mister with the current ability uh, 130. Okay, here you can check all the players and their current and potential abilities, but do we have some young players with a high potential? Actually, we have Christian Bjelic, uh, he's Serbian, but he doesn't have some special potential ability, only 120. Okay, then we have 21 years old, uh, Maximilia Maximiliano Lovera, I like this Argentinian. Uh, really nice speed, nice technique, uh, he's he's really interesting player. His potential ability is 135, not that big, but still can improve. Okay, then we have 21 years old, uh, Ruben, uh, he's actually on loan from Wolves, that's a problem, nice potential. Okay, the other players are not that young. Now let's check under 19 squad. Do we have some interesting kids there? And yes, we have one. Uh, that's Svetozar Markovic. Uh, he is on loan at Partizan Belgrade. Nice potential. Uh, 144. Uh, then we have Christos uh, Latsos, uh, fantastic Greek uh, player, very young Greek player, only 16 years old winger, guys. His potential ability is 137. This is not bad. I mean, he's only 16 years old, that's great. Okay, then we have Nikola Chumic, another Serbian player. A winger, very interesting winger, not bad potential, 135. The other players are not that good. Okay, and now I will show you some players that you should try to sign. Olympiakos doesn't have some great finances, transfer budget only around 2 million, wage budget the 500,000. That's not bad, at least for clubs in Greek Super League. Okay, so we can't afford some really expensive players, and this is my short list. First on that list is Marcos Leonardo, unknown Brazilian wunderkid. Amazing player, only 17 years old. 
and check this guys his potential ability is 167 this is really unbelievable i mean they don't want to sell him but they will accept your offer around five six million so you need to get money for this player that's for sure okay next is Mattia Cerezo. that's uh fantastic advances forward from uruguay and his price between one and three million really worth of buying fantastic potential ability very young next is rafael santos uh, colombian pressing forward check this he's already a class playing for river and uh, his price between three and four million he is also must buy okay uh, then next is Ahmed Musa because he's a free agent he can play as a winger he can play as a striker it would be really nice addition to the club yeah uh, then next, last on my list is another Colombian winger or striker that's Andres Sibargoen and his price between two and four million and at the end we are going to check team leaders there are three of them one is papadopoulos uh, avram papadopoulos greek central defender but he's 35 years old then we have costas fortunis we spoke about him and valbuena 35 years old playmaker uh, the biggest problem is that we don't have many players with a high influence so you need to search for some new faces with the leadership that would be really nice anyway guys this is my team and tactics guide for olympiakos very interesting club to manage in fm 2021